the Vanity Fair puff piece on Jerry Falwell Jr. is out, and he says we're to blame. I have three problems with that. Problem number one, he says it's unreasonable for us to expect him to live up to a high Christian standard just because of who his father is. My problem with that is that nobody forced him to live up to that standard. That's a standard that he created for himself, and it was a standard that wasn't accurate. The Vanity Fair piece makes it clear that he was living a double life. On the one hand, being the good and faithful servant that was expected of him by everybody in Christian circles, and on the other hand, living a life of partying and excess that anybody could live, which isn't a problem, except for the fact if you want people to see you one way, you have to live up to that standard. You can't cry foul after you're the one that's created the perception of holiness.